Assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Good morning, boys and girls. How are you today? Hope you're fine. Welcome to Unit 10, Part 1. So, today I'm going to talk to you about work. It's an everyday word, but it means different in science. So, can you name things that you call it work? Something you do, you call it work? Yes, while you are doing a classwork in class, it's work. And while you are doing your homework, also it's work. But in science, we call it differently. Work in science mean the use of a force, which means a push or a pull to move an object in the same direction as the force. Huh? What are you talking about, miss? Okay, let me tell you about something. If you want to push something or pull it away, you need to do some work to push it. If I want to push this one over here, I'm using force at the same direction to move it away. What if I want to pull it away? E so, pulling, I'm using force in the same direction to take it away. So, these we call it work. Using power or using force to make some work, we call it, in science, work. To make a push or a pull, we call it work. Okay, is it all the time I'm using my hand only? Think about if you want to dig a hole in sand. Are you going to use your hand? Yes, you may use your hand, but it's not going to make your life easier. If you want to dig easier, you can just use a shovel. So, what do we call a shovel? If this shovel making your work easier to take away the sand or pull the sand from down and put it inside the bucket, we call it a simple machine. What do I mean by a simple machine? A simple machine is whenever you are using something that makes your work, as in science, easier or more flexible. So we call it a simple machine. Think with me for a moment. What about if you want to move something away from one place to another? What are you going to use? Maybe um, a wagon? What about the wagon? Can you put stuff inside the wagon and take it away? You're taking away your stuff from one place to another? Yes, and do you know this wagon? What does it use? This wagon, simple machine called a wheel and axle because it has wheels and it has axle between the wheels. Tomorrow I'm going to talk to you more about wheel and axle, but let's focus today on a simple machine. Think of an, another simple machine that can help you or it can make your work easier, all right? Now, open with me please to page 404. 404. use it all right simple machines digging in a hole the sand moving a wagon load of toys Ooh, these of these jobs are work simple machines are useful because they make work easier yes that simple now look at this boy what he's doing this shovel handle is the simple machine all right it helps the boy lift sand more easily than he could on his own, right? What about this girl? What is this girl doing? This girl is using a wagon to do the work of moving things. So, the handle of the wagon is a simple machine called wheel and axle. It helps her steer and turn the wagon. 
All right? <laughs> now, what I want from you, find the highlighted words, the words we took today and its definition. Pause my video and take one minute to do it, please. All right. If you paused my video and found the two words, then must you play it again, the video. Now, look at this word, work. Work is the use of a force, which I mean a push or a pull to move an object in the same direction as the force. So this is what do I mean work in science, of course. See, this is what do I mean by work in what? In science. So this is a, an everyday word, but it's, it means differently in science. And what is a simple machine? A simple machine is something that makes work easier that's it and a simple machine has few or no moving parts so just like a wagon it has few moving parts or just like a shovel doesn't have any so to use it you apply only one for force which is your force all right please boys and girls look at the shovels below why are these shovel handles simple machines? Can you tell me why? Can you think of the answer? Yes, I'm sure you are pretty awesome to do it. Thank you for listening to me. That's it for today. Wake me tomorrow.